Alright guys, so here we go, we're going to do a uh, video review of a Dreamborn theme that I call, and it is called Arrow. Arrow is pretty much a Windows 7 theme, so we're going to go into it here. Alright, so pretty much you have your usual... <coughs> display and everything once you get on to uh, the application itself and everything so we can open up the camera that open up the camera and everything like that go back and you could do a whole bunch of stuff like mail, mental boards, stuff like that now one of the really cool things that I like about this type of theme right here is that it's got an amazing organization to it. Uh, you uh, you can click on this down here. What comes up is a whole bunch of YouTube files and everything such as that. You go to YouTube, you click there. You can keep clicking on the back right there. You can go to Dream Store. Go to end store. Everything such as that. PayPal and stuff like that. You just click on this again and it'll go down. Now a lot of these dream board programs, there's I think there should be a uh, theme that allows you to add or choose the type of icon you want and stuff like that. But sadly, I haven't came across one that has done that except uh, the HTC theme. But I'm going to show you around uh, its main organization right here. Simply. It opens up all these folders right here and everything. So pretty much what you have here, they you know is you open up apps, it gives you all your apps and everything. You can see see that's all my apps. You press back over here. Then another really cool thing here is that you can actually personalize your theme to what you want so let's say if I want blue bomb would change to blue and everything so with that go back and everything Cydia gets all your applications from Cydia and it puts it in here. You can also update the weather and everything. That would get iTunes if you had iTunes, but I removed iTunes. You get your tools. Again, if you had any. But again, again, if you had games, you could go up in here. Social. I'm sure I'm going all over so you guys can see what it's going to be in any, anything like that. And as you can see, nothing's in there. But what I do like about this is that you can change your background color to whatever you want. I think that's pretty cool. Now you can't change the wallpaper if you were trying to see if you could do that, but you can't. And with that, you just click right out of that, and that would be gone. So, say if you want to change the weather, just formulate your thing that you want to do. Clock, there's your clock. 
we can do that. We want to open up this. You'd go to the website you want to go to. Look up Safari and everything. So as I give every video or every app that I have, I give it a uh, rating at the end of the video. So on a scale of one to ten, I'd rate this a nine point five. Mainly and only mainly because of its organization. Now, if you're a more organized guy and you want to have a more simplistic theme, I think you want to go with the Ergo theme, the Ergo AT. And that, that's the one you should go for. But overall, this theme, is, you can do a whole lot of things with it. So if you're looking for a theme that Windows 7 based and everything such as that, then this is the perfect one for you. Then, yep. Only downfalls is that I think there's not enough edit ability options. If it only had that ability to edit more things than just okay, let's open up to certain things and let's do this, this, and that, then it'd be better. But sadly, it doesn't have that. But still, if you want organization, you want everything to be neat. You want a good theme, and you want everything to be just really good. It this theme is probably one of the best Dreamboard themes out there. It's pretty good. Out of all the other ones that I've seen, and all the other ones that I've done, the only one that kind of compares to this is the like Boxer HD and stuff like that. But besides that, it's a 9.5. So comment, rate, subscribe, and bye.